Thank you very much. Um, uh, I would like to link uh, the presentation from His Excellency the Ambassador to that of uh, Malcolm Borge. Um, I think it's fantastic that we kick off an event such, um, like this with agriculture. And I also think it's fantastic that we, we learn from Holland. The reason being that I'm obsessed with slurry, pig and cow slurry. You know? And I do, I do research work on, 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 on this waste stream, because unfortunately it's, it's classified as waste stream. Um, uh, but what I've learned from the Netherlands in particular is that the government subsidizes farmers, livestock breeders, okay? to generate electricity on farm with the manure their, their, livestock, um, uh, their livestock produce, and in return they get electricity and they also get biofertilizer. And when the first time I met um, uh, Melkin Borch, a couple of years ago, Melkin, um, you encouraged me to, uh, to, to, to research this, this topic further. Because in Malta what we do is we grab this, um, uh, this slurry and literally we chuck it down the drain with all the greenhouse gas emissions that emanate from our sewage treatment plants. So what we do at the moment is, um, what, I, what I'm doing at the moment with the farming community is, we recover this, um, this biofertilizer to be used in, uh, in fields locally. Because the farmers import fertilizers. They import chemical fertilizers from abroad, and then we dispose of our own. So this is, this is the effort and I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm working on at the moment, and I thought it would be appropriate to link these two speakers. But you know what the farmers tell me about the biofertilizer? Chris, you can take the biofertilizer, but give us back the water. Because from, the fifth, from all the manure we treat, 50% we recover as clean water. But they say we have much more pressing issues with water than with biofertilizer. They say to me in Maltese, Minaw Khabibtiye Kinyaddi Kinyaddi Lilma, Ilo Ashar Sneen Mayadil Lilma. 10 years ago, we used to have a stream of water flowing through our fields. 10 years ago, we've never seen it again. And this is, it's happening. Climate change is happening. The potato exporters, Melkin mentioned, the potato exporters, they're facing terrible repercussions of the increase in temperatures. The tuber worm, Susa, tal patata, eh, bil, uh, bil malti, that used to occur in the summer, eh, when, when it was hot, when the soils were hot. It, it, it occurs all the year round. Eh? The people in Zabar who, who, who cultivate this crop, this is, the, this is the feedback they get. So I think it was appropriate to kickstart climate change um, uh, conference with these two topics.